Our first look at the man who cops a shot a three year old boy this weekend in the Bronx. That innocent boy, a little innocent bystander. He was out for a walk with his mom. Eyewitness News reporter Josh Einiger has more as that suspect now awaits to face a judge. It's really remarkable this wild shooting over the weekend didn't have worse fallout, but that didn't make it any less urgent to catch the shooter. And tonight, police say they have their man. This is 20 year old Freddy Flores, who emerged from the detective squad here at the 5 2 precinct on his way to central booking, accused of spraying a busy street corner with bullets, one of which hit a two year old boy. It happened just after lunchtime Saturday at Fordham Road in the Grand Concourse, a corner packed with people out and about on a bright early spring afternoon. Cops say Flores was in a fight with someone and opened fire from across the street, pulling the trigger five times on a nine millimeter handgun. He did not hit his target, but a two year old boy did wind up with a bullet in the hip. He's been hospitalized since then actually celebrated his third birthday in the hospital, though police say he is going to recover. Flores was caught by a fugitive task force, but they didn't have to look far. It turned out he was checking into criminal court in Manhattan on a grand larceny case from more than a year ago when they did catch up to him this afternoon. The charges this time around are a lot more serious, though he's facing attempted murder, criminal possession of a weapon, and reckless endangerment. At this hour, he is beginning his journey through the Bronx criminal court system. That's the latest from the 5-2 precinct in the Norwood section of the Bronx. Josh Einiger, Channel 7 Eyewitness News.